Hello and welcome. Big changes to RF4, including the New Year event. Uh, I will share the New Year's event with you, but more importantly, what changes have happened today to the game? Uh, let's see here. The most interesting change that I've seen is there's five new fish species on Yama River. Uh, so this coming weekend, I definitely want to stream at Yama and try to catch these fish. Another huge change that we've all been looking for is the durability of the WTA line guides on Pilker and Boat Rods have been increased. So if I go into my inventory, if you guys remember, uh, the line guides 1.6% damage. I've barely fished with this. I just got this rod and numerous people have complained at how quickly uh, these have degraded. Uh, over time so that is a very good change by how much have they reduced it no one knows uh personal experience will tell uh so in addition to that the cost of repairing electric reels uh, real engines has been reduced well those are for the very rich people that i am not another very interesting change that has happened is adjustments were made to the preferences of fish on yama river and norwegian this is a little scary uh, because, you know, Hunter 1000 and the Pilker 800 uh, used to work uh, or lack of. Uh, so maybe now, you know, there's a little bit of change. What I can say, however, is looking at VK is at the 34 and the 41 meter hole. People are fishing right now uh, with the Lurker 100 and they are still doing good. Uh, I haven't seen a proper net. Uh, with the totals, but they are still doing good, which means the Lurker 100 with foam or the shrimps uh, should still work for you if you want to level up quick. Uh, so that is good. Uh, so another change, another adjustment uh, in the patch notes, they say is the fish preference for the marine rigs. Giant silicon jigging rig, dead fish jigging rig, and bottom with rattling weight uh have had changes so i wonder for those high marine skill level people uh we're gonna have to wait and see how they do now maybe they don't get anything or maybe they get huge fish maybe the buy rates are faster now and everything else remains the same i don't know so it'll be very interesting to see another huge thing guys another huge thing the wariness of fish species to the presence of running boat motor nearby has been reduced uh this means that uh tunguska trolling archipelago trolling uh volkov trolling and kori trolling should see an increase in the amount of fish and thus increase in the income so I hope since trolling has been dead ever since the sea came out uh, or ever since they increased the wariness of the fish uh, near boats, I hope that these maps become alive again uh, because it's very, it's really sad that this game has so many maps and majority of them are just dead. Like how many people, you know, go to Sura River? You only have roach, sometimes silver. Harps go alive, and that's pretty much it. There's there's nothing else. So I really hope uh, these maps uh, become alive again. So happy hour bonus uh, has been added. Uh, so there is that. And finally, uh, I guess we can see grocery store same as every other year. I might buy a cup of tea more cup of tea because i am low uh where are my drinks here only 213 tea thermoses and 1000 cups of tea i don't know how many 10,000 or how many i bought last winter tackle store uh, everything should be the sta same and let's go ahead to the 2024 new year's challenge they have made it much harder than previous years Previous years, all we did was float fish from the dock uh, at uh, at Mosquito, and that was it. Just keep catching fish, if I remember correctly. Sorry, you would catch literally the gift bag, and that was it. It was just a game of time. 
but now it's challenging. So for free people, this is what you get. And for premium, you get all of these in addition, another seven stages. So how do they go? Well, if you see here, catch a crucian or gibble, that is at least one kg on mosquito. If you click on it, it will tell you the details. Fish species, you can either catch a crucian or a gibble that's above one kg, and it's only possible on mosquito lake. You can use any rod. Pretty easy. Uh, 700 gram roach, okay, cool. Uh, seven species of fish on mosquito using float. You can use telescopic Balinese match. All right, seven species. That's okay, not too bad. Uh, and then it gets harder and harder. Like 1.5 kg chub. Okay, that's a little difficult. 2.5 kg on a telescopic rod. I am like, what, 53% in float fishing, and I feel like this is too difficult for me either. Uh, 2.5 kg, I don't know if I've ever caught a 2.5 on float so that'll be interesting to see so at a wide-eyed bream 350 gram unwinding rivulet i've never caught a wide-eyed bream actually i have but that was on spin fishing when i was fishing for perch uh, so pick a rod feeder rod carp rod so this is probably nighttime activity so you have 30 days to complete this and this requires you to do a lot 15 species of fish on mosquito that is a proper task that is a proper marathon so a lot harder than previously uh, previously you just closed your eyes and just sat at the dock and spent hours and hours and hours this year if you like objectives if you like a challenge it's really good i like it uh but man it is a lot harder so uh, i don't think i'm gonna waste my time with this because the rewards aren't even worth it uh, the only reward that's worth it is maybe the premium and that's about it so you don't it doesn't even say what kind of rewards you can get from these gift packs which is unfortunate and then there's premium uh so yeah oh god oh no thunderstorm so yeah that is just a quick video i wanted to show you guys on the newest updates uh this coming weekend i'm gonna stream a lot hopefully and uh, show you guys or be with you guys and see is the sea still the same has our earnings gone up and definitely 100% ayama i want to see what new fish there are and has the fishing gotten any better at yama we're about to find out please hit that like button please subscribe please let me know how you found this update if you have any tips for yama on what spots you've had good luck with please let us know so this weekend when i stream we have a better chance and I hope to see you there. Thank you so much for watching guys. Bye.